Hello, hello. Today we're going to be playing Motortown Behind the Wheel. Uh, we started a new character because they've had so many new updates to the game. I want to give it a tryout. So it says the first quest is drive the Tucson, Tucson Tuscan. This beautiful blue muscle car called Tucson is yours. Put the driver's side door and enter the vehicle. Okay. That's the straps. Uh, is it? No, it's about to get in. Oh, drive. Okay. Pick up a hitchhiker. Okay, here we go. I am using a controller for this. Uh, let's see. Hitchhiker is... Okay. Okay, it's directing me to one. Okay, here we go. Now... No, not this way. Okay. Uh, we want not this one. Next one after that now. Is it... Uh... It's going to tell me. Right now, I sport mode. I typically prefer to be in um, comfort mode just because I'm not driving like a crazy man. Okay. Hello, Hitchhiker. Where are we going today? Okay. Hitchhiker. Can I get a ride? Okay, sure. Deliver Hitchhiker. Okay. So here we go down the road. Uh, I'm supposed to go up to the next one. We'll get there. And here we go. Now, in the career mode, basically you can do anything you want to as far as like jobs. There are some prerequisites sometimes, but in general, you're pretty free to do anything. You don't have a vehicle, you can always borrow one, and they, the owner of the vehicle will take a cut of the money. But then you don't have to worry about gas or repairing it either, which is kind of nice if you're going to be stupid. That's kind of a nice benefit there. Oh, they put speed bumps up there, okay. Those were here last time I played. Now, I don't think there's any reward for really for taking hitchhikers, because it's not like a reputation system I've seen, but... I mean, there's experience for doing the quest, but... You're welcome very much. Yeah, I got 100 goodwill, zero money, 100 experience. Use drift driving mode, okay. Use the R. Comfort mode, okay. Now I want to go to a pickup truck. So we're going to do some deliveries now. And I put them right. Yeah, I'm, I've messed with this. In, oh, man. Okay, here we go. Now, my personal favorite thing to do in this game is uh, tow trucks. Because it's really fun, and it pays really well. And it can be a little difficult, not too bad, so... Okay, here we go. Now, you also have to be careful with your speed, stuff like that, and driving like an idiot, because there are police in the game, and they will try and give you a ticket. If you're being stupid. Okay, so we'll just go over here for now. I'll jump out of the car, now watch me drive a pickup truck. I can get into this one here. Pick up cargo. Sure. Now over here. We go over here. Okay. So we can take a pumpkin box to someone. Okay. And we can also take a corn box. That's 6.8 kilometers away though. Where's the other one at? Oh, 5.2? No, that's too far away in our direction, wrong direction. No. Okay, well.
And as you can see on the bottom of the GPS, it does go ahead and There we go, okay. Now we're starting our little pumpkins across the county. In our rented pickup truck. And as you can see, the equipment is not exactly locked down in the back of the truck, so we could potentially lose this cargo if we flip or something, which I very rarely for cars but the uh, ways to bounce around the back they probably come a little free softened okay uh, let's see where the 70 on I'm going 75 probably should slow down just a hair let it coast down a little bit 70 there we go that's good You're going too slow. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. Okay. Kick on the speed. Get away from the bus driver. He's going a little too slow for me. So far, my first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to do some deliveries, maybe get a little bit of money, but uh, I need to get the rent a Pulio, basically, one of the pickup trucks, and then work my way up to getting the money for it and anything else I need. Living cargo is a really good experience, though, too, especially the bigger stuff. Okay, here we go, here we go, driving, driving, driving. Okay, that's the main road done. I do like the rain effects in this game. It's pretty, really, uh, really pretty. And I've got 800 meters left to go. Just about a kilometer left. We are kind of hoofing a little bit here, though. So, oh, actually, we're not doing okay. We're at 90 speed. So we're fine. The high speed road. I was speeding for a minute. Didn't want to anger a cop. I can't drive 55. Okay. Here comes our turn. Little mini bus. Okay, I gotta go up two turns. Yeah, we're all fine behind him. We'll let him go. We're gonna stop here. 
does look like the traffic is driving better, which is nice. Because uh, last patch, the traffic was going a little wonky and not doing, driving very well. So, let's see. Here's your pickup. So I got $300, but the car owner took $759. I get level two driving. Ah, let's see. Open this up. Uh, what is it? No, not that. No, it's not that. This. There it is, okay. Can I do anything here? No. A bean pallet, that's a long, I don't have to do a long pallet. Oh, that's just like expensive ones, never mind. That's like a pickup for food. Okay, let's see, I need to get all delivery. And let's see, we're here. That's the burger joint now. Pizza now. Sashimi now. Shark site won't have anything for that. Airport. Now, what are you down here? Cargo space to Shanker now. Ah, uh, boxes. Okay, that's where we'll go. Okay, now we'll go this way. So we hit driver level two so far. Not too bad, not too bad. Okay. And here. Yeah. I'm going to play with the controls a little bit here because it just feels like stopping and starting is really a little over clicky. I get her like fully stop and clicking twice or so to get the uh, gas bug going the other direction basically. Yeah. No cop, no stop. Okay. Okay, into the gate, I guess. Yeah, looks like it. Try backing up to it. Or maybe just have my nose in there would be enough, but there now pick up delivery. Okay. Glass bottle, five point one kilometers I think closer, three point one. Load, 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 load. Okay. Let's go into Resonant 5.6. Are you any chance near them? You are. Load, load. Okay. Now get out. Now hit Y. Okay, strap cargo. There we go. Everything's strapped down. There we go. Put those away, get in the car. And let's go. Yeah, I haven't played this in a while, so I'm a little rusty in the controls, but I'll get better.
That's the taxi one, okay. So I need to go here. Hello, excuse me, excuse me. Okay, 6,000, 20 extra for the town. So made 5,000 bucks for that. Go this way. There's another one here. Let's look at those. Uh, map. Oh, he's over there. Okay. He's just hiding behind the town, the building. Okay. Yeah, first time you actually only see the taxi one. Yeah, they did put speed bumps in here. It's going to slow me down from driving through this town like crazy mode, man. That's not cool. So you can definitely make some money just delivering things here. Okay. Cool. And another 2400 after this up in person. So, that being said, this has been the first episode of Motor Shop Behind the Wheel, 2024 edition. I want to thank you for watching. Have a wonderful, wonderful day, and goodbye. Please like, follow, and subscribe. Out.